Hi guys, I'm gonna give this a try. So I just wanna show you something about X and Y coordinates that will help make this whole process a little bit better. So I want you to imagine that this is the game screen here. You can see that my whiteboard drawing abilities really uh, transition well to using a computer. So what I want you to understand is, number one, that the top le left corner, see how good I'm getting at this, uh, is position zero on the X and zero on the Y. So that's the top left. Now, as you move across the screen, so say we're going to go left to right, the position on the X coordinate is going to get bigger. So the furthest to the left that you can go is zero on the X, and then all the way across the room, that's gonna be the maximum position, which you can use the built-in variable called room width. So room width is as far to the right as you can get on the room. Now the Y coordinate works kind of the same way. The further down the screen you go, the higher your, your Y coordinate is gonna be, and the maximum position down the, at the bottom of the screen is room underscore height. So depending on what you have your room set for, you could have it say 640 by 480, the maximum room width would be 640, um, and the maximum height would be 480, but if you use room width and room height instead of those numbers, that actually works out well because then it automatically will adapt to those changes.